a lot of people have a lot of opinions about art, whether or not that should be a demonstration of skill, and representation, purely expression, or somewhere in between. Somewhere in this discussion, abstract expressionism is bound to pop up, with those critiquing it saying it lacks skill, talent, and anyone can do it. But funnily enough, these same people tend to know very little about the movement itself. The movement exists as a result of cameras making traditional art meaningless, both as a market and a skill. Artists in response had to find new ways to keep their work relevant, and found abstract to be the perfect subject. Mark Rothko found that using blocks of colour on a massive canvas had the effect of influencing emotions, and his paintings became solely about expression. Jackson Pollock aimed to create work that showed anyone could create art, and yet still be individual as a way to subvert the industry, though accidentally reinforced it. These are basic facts about abstract expressionism, but nonetheless facts that the general public is unaware of when discussing the movement. And while this information might recontextualise abstract expressionism, whether or not it changes your opinions is up to you.